Zwom Bimo. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Bimo Creative. This is a Neverwinter Let's Play and we are up on Mount Hote now. And we're about to collect some seeds that are apparently still up here someplace. We are level 70 on our way to 80, moving fast. So we've got four seeds to collect, so let's get right to it. Let's see, the sparkling path is leading this way. Why this guy's not wearing any clothes is beyond me, but he's he's got a nice horse. Okay, anyway. Uh, let's see, seeds, seeds. I guess the seeds could be anywhere in this area, so... Let's see, I see... This uh, tree over here is sparkling, so that means that maybe that's where I collect the seeds. Correct. Okay, so we just got three more to go. So let's just run down here and see where we can find some seeds. Here's some. Good. Uh, there's some over there, so I got to get past these guys. Whoa. Man, these fire elementals are really dangerous. If if they don't get you with their fire, they get you by blowing up. Okay, so we've got three out of four. One more set of seeds. Looks like he's kind of in trouble. Oh, great. He just set those guys off, too. I'll take care of it. That's what you get for helping, folks. Look at that. Sent those guys over to me. That's okay. We could use the experience. Okay, here's one more. One more tree that has seeds at the foot of it. We're done. So, Heartleaf is the um, elf druid's name that's up here. Heartleaf, that's a cool name. I know this is a random fact, but being a geek and all, I just happen to know that the herb that the Black Panther uses for some of his powers, it's actually kind of helps him control the demon. There are a few things I could use your help with. It kind of helps him protect, uh, help uh, control the demon Bast in his in his soul, but basically. It's a it's a heart shaped herb, so I thought that was interesting. The pressure under the mountain is already subsiding. It's not a permanent fix, but it might give us enough time to stop gum off the twisted. And not being incinerated by a volcanic eruption is a pretty good thing too. Yeah, I agree with you, man. Good. So yeah, Heartleaf, that's a cool name. I don't know how it has a Black Panther connotation to it, but uh, it just made me think of it. One day, my tree will be the heart of a great forest. If we live, of course. Yeah. From this handful of seeds, a new forest of my sister trees will one day grow and live again. Thank you. You are welcome. Warm Earth. Strong. Geologist Donny has told me the bodies of elemental monsters called flame spikers contain a very rich kind of clay that could both protect the seeds and spur their growth. Could you help me once more by harvesting some of this elemental clay? Harvesting clay? You mean killing flame spikers? But yeah, I can do that. Shadowfire Cavern. Trace the path of the pressure you left it, and all events lead to a central point. A lava chamber called the Shadowfire Cavern. It makes sense. One of my prospectors reported he found a magma elemental there before the attacks started. He went back to investigate. He returned. If that magma elemental is under the control of Gamoth, it was probably responsible for the near eruption. It needs to be destroyed. Okay, that sounds like a dungeon run. I mean, he talked a lot, but basically it sounds like a dungeon run. So maybe we will do the dungeon run. 
and collect some of this elemental stuff along the way. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to that cavern. Where is this place you're talking about? Man, that sounds fun. Oh man, I hope we're powerful enough to survive it. Where are we going? Yeah, don't bother me. I'm busy right now. Don't bother me. Oh, here. This has got to be it. Man, look at this. A big, giant, glowing path of death. That's got to be a dungeon run, if I've ever seen one. I know my dungeon runs. Oh, wow. Look at this. This is incredible looking. Very hot. Very, very hot. Wow. What in the world? Alrighty, then. Let's, uh... Make sure we're as good as we're going to get here. It looks like it. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, man, I could actually use another um, artifact. I forgot about that. Um, you know, I've got my little book here. What is this? Ogma's token of free movement. Gives me seven deflection. Or I could use... That's not my artifact. Where's my artifact? Oh, man. There it is. This little guy. Critical avoidance. He gives me critical avoidance. Hmm. You know, I think I'm going to go with him because... There we go. Now I'm as full as I can be. Tough as I'm going to get, I guess. Uh, you know, come to think of it, let's move this down here more room okay let's do it these are archers so they're kind of like fire archers I know I'm supposed to go up there but I gotta see if there's treasure over here otherwise why are these guys over here See, that took seven arrows. Yeah, I'm not as tough as I would like to think I am. Nothing over here, just a big lava pit. Okay. Man, I was really hoping for some treasure. Make me feel better about this dungeon we're running here. Do fire monsters care about treasure? I don't know. I do know he said they sent a dwarf down here, though, so if... If a dwarf was willing to go, then there's got to be... What do I see over there? Treasure box? Yeah. Just take care of these elementals really quick and then... Grab that treasure box. And it is a... I think it's a mimic. Because my target does not have the gold bag on the right hand side of it when I cover over it so this I think it's a mimic so I'm gonna get ready here all right mr. mimic surely he's got some good stuff in here for me come on come on is there armor anything good really nothing good really oh man I am shocked and in awe and completely embarrassed for that mimic. That poor guy hasn't had a decent meal. Not enough adventurers come down here for him to eat and take their treasure. Oh well. Let's see. I see four fire elementals. Okay, I think we're good to just shoot them from here. Oh, they're the teleporting time. Yeah, that was a good, good technique. Oh, whoa, hello. How did I miss this giant? How did I miss him? I guess I got him. I shot him from a distance. Right under the chin, man. 
learn that maneuver from Legolas. Remember? In the first Lord of the Rings? The Fellowship of the Ring? He shot that cave troll right under the chin with an arrow. Went through that tiny brain of his and he went down in a heap. Okay, here we go. Nice, nice. Okay, good. Okay, this has got to be a mimic. Come on, please be a mimic. It is a mimic. Oh, but man, if I kill it down here, there's treasures going to go all in this lava. So I think I'm going to activate him and then run up here and kill it up here because hopefully I can get all the treasure it has. Let's try it. Don't fall in the lava, Mimic. Just run up here. Come on. Come on. There he comes. Yes. He had armor. Gold. Nothing fell off the cliff. Awesome plan. Good plan. All right. Let's see. What kind of armor is it? Is it good? It is not good. It's terrible. Uh, let's see. Is it any better? No. No, it doesn't look any better than what I'm wearing. It looks basically, yeah, it looks a lot like what I'm wearing. Oh, man. Okay. Well, at least he did have more stuff. Wow, this guy's tough. There's some sort of... Oh man, don't tell me I can't get that treasure. Uh, let me jump up here. Okay, jump up here. Jump up here. Uh, come on. Jump, jump, jump. I'm going to get stuck if I try this. Uh, come on. Uh, jump up here. Jump, 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 jump. Come on, dude. You can do it. You can do it. There you go. Yes, got the treasure. I hate to just leave perfectly good treasure laying around. I see a bag up there, but I can't really... I can't open it. Okay, well, hey, you know what? I did not leave it. I see treasure up there on that cliff. Oh, yeah, I will climb lava cliffs to get you some me some treasure. Oh, yeah. What's the point of doing dungeon runs if you're not going after the treasure? Okay, big boss. Well, maybe a medium boss. This might be the big boss. Magma Elemental is all it says. I don't remember if the guy gave me a name or not. He was kind of rambling and I kind of got bored. Ooh, more treasure. Oh, come on. What? We can do this. Yes. Okay, dude. Um, I say we shoot him, pin him to the ground, move out of the way as soon as he targets us. Yes, good move. Oh, wow, what? He has buddies? I did not expect him to have buddies. Whoa, dodge. There, got him. Got him and his buddies. He's not going to blow up? Oh, that's interesting. I would have expected him to blow up. He didn't blow up. He's just laying there. Wow. Now that's... Oh, boy. It's across a cliff. Oh, here's some dried magma I can run across to get to the treasure. Will I go underneath a lava waterfall to run over here, or a lava fall to run over here and get treasure? You better believe it. Okay, let's go around here. Any more treasure? No? The dwarf has got to be close by here, man. He was in the right place if he was, because I have found three or four treasure boxes right here in this one area. 
So he's got to be close by. And this is another treasure box, but I just can't open it. There he is. It's good to see some help. I've been trapped up here for quite a while. Fortunately for me, I always pack double rations. You need to get to Historian Brimble and the others in the camp near the bridge. Tell them that this elemental was under the control of a fire archon general named Ignazar. I think he's got a fortress in the burning ruins. I am going to keep mapping out the cavern and event system. Darnie probably thinks I'm dead, <laughs> but he was always a gloomy one. Uh. Yeah, dude, he does think you're dead. I will take... Oh, never mind. You're welcome. I will take my ring, though. Thank you. And you're going to stay here? All right. I'll tell everybody that you're on your way out. Yeah, that was good. That was a good dungeon run. Oh, man, we still got to collect some uh, clay from spikers we can do that we can collect clay from spikers spiker clay I guess you could call it here's some spikers dudes I need your clay you have clay yes she was right there is some clay among these spikers that's it oh man okay let's go on up here what? Who's coming after me? Oh. Don't need anything from you guys. Sorry. Oh, wow. What? You guys asked for it. See? You mess with the bull and you get the horns. That's how it works, guys. Yeah, get the horns. All right, let's see here. Spikers. I know I saw a bunch of spikers up here somewhere. No. I think they were all the way up at the top, up here by the shafts. Yeah, they, they were coming out of the shafts, right? Right? Weren't there some spiker dudes over here? No? What is going on, man? Where are my spikers? Oh, this guy's getting them all. Another adventurer was getting them all. Oh, wow, that's a lot of dwarves. Okay. Spikers, where are you? Where are my spikers? There's one. One spiker? He had one piece of elemental. Ah, oh, here's some, here's another one. Okay. He didn't have any. No elemental clay. Oh man. I need two more spikers. Where am I going to find a couple of spikers? Where are you guys at? What is down there? Well, I saw another uh, adventurer, so probably they would have taken out the spikers if they're on the same mission I'm on. Let's try back up here. Man, there's adventurers running around everywhere. It's a busy day for adventuring, I guess. I'm going farther than I should, heading this way, taking a huge risk because I'm heading towards where the uh, other set of adventures are, but I felt like I might happen upon some spikers here. Maybe not. I'm going to go down here. None. Really? Man, I am just shocked by this. Okay, let's back up this way.
The fire elementals are far more common than the spikers. Oh boy. They hit me enough times I'm going to fall off my um, ride here and... Whew, okay, they didn't attack. Good. I just kind of startled them, I guess. And I'm going to go back down this way. I don't know what else to do. Head back down this way and maybe come across a couple more spikers. There's a couple right there. Great. Hey, guys. I need your clay. Come on. Please tell me you had some. One. Man. Really? Ah, another spiker. Where am I going to come across one? Let's see here. You guys wouldn't happen to know any spikers, would you? No? Okay, let's go this way. No, 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 no. Not looking for you guys. Zombie Duragar. Who would have thunk it? There's a spiker. We got our clay. Mission accomplished. Let's go back to Heartleaf and call it a day, people. Let's do this. Hurry, hurry, hurry. It's a lot of running around. Just like in the Lord of the Rings movies, man. You just set a path and you go and it could take a while to get there. But it's worth it once you reach your destination. Get to talk oh, to Heartleaf. My tree will be the heart of a great forest. If we live, of course. Maybe she'll hook us up. Oh, 17 right. silver. That's good. This clay is warm, wonderful soil indeed. It's fitting the elemental creatures who caused such harm to the wood will help to grow a new forest. So you, I collected seeds for you. I collected clay for you. Are you going to have me plant some trees? Yeah. Planting for the future. There you go. I wish to plant the seeds you gathered, but I am too weak to leave my tree for long. You have already helped me so much. Can I ask for your help once more to sow the first seeds of a new forest? Yeah, you know, I'm I'm running around anyway. Uh, yeah, I don't mind. So, okay. Let's run around here. <gasps> Treasure right here by the tree. How did I not see that? Wow, right here by the tree, people. Anyway, let's jump up here. All right. Okay, everybody, this has been another BMO Creative Neverwinter Let's Play. We are squaring away Hope now as quickly as possible, working with Heartleaf and Prospectors, and we just did a dungeon run. And So if you like this kind of thing, please go ahead and, and give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Thanks so much.